Hey there, in this video, I'm going to show you guys three methods to reverse your clips in DaVinci Resolve. So let's get straight to it. I've taken this clip of a guy who's holding a smoke bomb. So once I play the video, all the smoke starts coming out. Now, after we reverse the video, the obviously expected output will be all the smoke going back into the smoke bomb like this. All right, so let's get started. Now, note this before you actually make the changes to the clip and reverse it. If you want to see a little preview of it, you can do that by going to the end of the video. And in the source monitor, just click on this button, which says play reverse. So you'll get to see how your clip will actually look once you reverse it. So let's get started with the first method. Here all you have to do is simply right click on the clip, go to Retime Controls. It also has a shortcut control R, you can remember it, okay? Just click on it. After you do that, a little box will appear here. It will say Speed Change, it will say the name of the file and this little 100% it will also have arrows that are facing right. So simply click on this arrow down here and click on Reverse Segment and we're done. These arrows are facing left now and we have reversed our clip. If you play the clip, see the smoke is going back in. So that was the first method. In the second method, right click on the clip and go to change clip speed instead of retime controls. Change clip speed, click on it. Then this little window will open up here. All you have to do is simply press on reverse speed and hit change. And we're done. The clip has been reversed. If you play it, you can see it. The third method is the fastest of the three methods and is basically a quicker version of the second one. Now, if you remember the second one, we right clicked on the clip, we went to change clip speed and then this window popped up. So in the third method, what we are going to do is simply click on the clip and press a shortcut, which is R button. And then this window will directly pop up. After that, all you have to do is click on reverse speed and hit on change and you have reversed the clip. So basically it saves you two more clicks, but we are humans. It is in our nature to use the faster method to reach our goal. So yeah, the third method is my favorite method of all of the three. And that brings us to the end of this video, guys. I hope you found these methods useful. And if you did, make sure you leave a like. It really helps the algorithm suggest this video to the needful people. Share this video with your friends. And finally, consider subscribing to the channel. I post such DaVinci Resolve tutorials. I've got a whole playlist of it. I stream games every week. And occasionally, I post some knowledgeable yet entertaining videos on this channel. So that's it from my side. Thank you for watching the video. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.